Assalamu alaikum. Muhammad Ali Basha, the founder of modern Egypt, part B. He also sent native missions to study in various European countries, especially France. Different important fields of knowledge were covered by these missions, such as military disciplines, engineering, medicine, pharmacy, and arts, in order to provide his modern schools with the books they needed, Muhammad Ali ordered an Arabic printing press to be set up. Indeed, Napoleon brought with him an Arabic printing press, but he took it back to France when he withdrew from Egypt. Muhammad Ali's press was to play a very important cultural role in the Arab and Muslim world in general and in Egypt in particular. It printed translations of European works, whether scientific or literary. In addition to some major works of classical Arabic literature, it also printed the first official gazette under the Arabic title Al Waqa'a Al Masriya. It is worthy of note that this gazette marked the birth of journalism, which was to become a potent factor in the development not only of modern Arab thought, society and politics, but also modern Arabic literature. One of the major concerns of Muhammad Ali was the Egyptian army, which he reorganized and modernized with the help of a French colonel called Sev, who professed Islam under the name Suleiman Basha, in commemoration of his military service, one of the principal streets in the center of Cairo was named after him. Relying on this powerful army, Muhammad Ali launched an external policy built on expansion. He held control over the two holy cities of Mecca and Medina. Moreover, he expanded Egyptian power in the Sudan and in 18 31 began to threaten the Ottoman authority over Syria. He even posed a real threat to the Ottoman Empire itself, but the European powers intervened and put an end to his ambitions. But Despite all his achievements, Muhammad Ali committed some grave mistakes, the worst of which was his notorious massacre of the Mamluks in the citadel of Salah al Din in 1811 AD, after receiving them in a banquet. He also rid himself of the power of the ulama, who helped him to ascend the throne. Thus, he faced no opposition and became an autocratic ruler in the full sense of the word. But, 
but he was able to make Egypt an autonomous and hereditary principality and to launch it on the way to modernization. Muhammad Ali abdicated in 1848 AD in favor of his son Ibrahim and died in 1849 AD. Wassalamu alaikum.